job specific language training and bridge training and other things like mentoring, newcomers to Ontario are well equipped to meet the challenges of working in a new country. But government depends on people on the ground, business leaders and internationally trained professionals like yourselves. And so we've got to continue our dialogue and share ideas on how to build diverse workplaces that can thrive and can grow. And that's what all of you are committed to doing right here today. But anytime you want to make change, whether you're trying to increase your new Canadian or immigrant um, employee population within your organization, or any change you're trying to make in your organizations, whether it's profit, not for profit, uh, government, so on, you have to have a business case. Like, tell me why I should do it. Tell me why I should change. Tell me why I should try to hire someone with a Canadian experience. So in order to do that, you need to explain to them what it is. Now, if you're in a for-profit company, you just tell them how it's going to drive more revenue and they're with you. That's all they want. If you're in a not-for-profit, if it's going to help you drive uh, more donations or contributions, or it's going to make you more effective as an organization, these things are very helpful in terms of getting senior leaders or all people in the organization to change. But if people feel comfortable and included, and this is your customers and employees, they're much more, you see discretion every effort increase, so they're much more likely to fully participate in the work environment. And you see productivity also rise within your employees as well, because they're not so worried about fitting in or what do I have to do to make sure that I'm hiding this part of my life. But having people and having a workforce that represents every type of client that your business may interface with is extremely important. And when you think about a lot of organizations who, again, are trying to get ahead of the demographic curve and are looking to the future to be progressive, a lot of companies, us included, have come up with a newcomer to Canada plan or a newcomer offer specifically geared to helping for products and services, helping the newcomers get established within Canada. And we're smart to do so, and organizations continue to be smart to do so, but who better to advise us as to how we market, how we build products, how we service that customer than newcomers themselves. I think it's really important to be able to network with peers to discuss best practices. I think in the area of diversity, we're often at the corporate level, we find that we have very similar challenges and often you know, someone's got the secret to success that we can share with each other. So I think the value of today is being able to network with peers to have very candid uh, and open dialogue around the struggles that we're having but also communicate the successes that we're having as well and to be able to get that information and share it. So there are lots of places where when we say diversity we really are talking about multiculturalism, anti-racism, equity and inclusion. And that's what our work is about, getting people from where they are to create truly inclusive environments. And that's what this workshop is about. And the bottom line around language, I have to add this because I'm obsessive compulsive in the disability movement around the language we use around disability is, the bottom line is, as long as it's a term of respect and dignity, it's usable. These kinds of programs are very, very important because it brings together human resources professional as well as people from some of the community organizations who can assist companies, institutions, organizations to create truly equitable and inclusive workplaces. What that does is enhance the sense of well-being, uh, accessibility, satisfaction of all their employees and when you have an inclusive workplace that certainly does enhance your company, it enhances your business, it gives you a competitive edge and you're able to retain loyal employees who feel respected and valued at work.